to go. There we go. 10 to 15 on the squats. Kimberly, bro, why are you looking at me like you're not, like you're confused? <laughs> 10 to 15 on those squats. I can say the drop squats or regular body weight squats, whatever works. Nice job, nice job. After that, we're gonna take it into a forward lunge and twist, forward lunge and twist. Alternate sides, twist toward the leg, that's lunge forward, please. Get three to five on each side, three to five on each side. Going, we have one more on each side, and then we'll step it out. That lateral lunge, we step out. You can do all on one side at first, and then switch the other one three to five on each side, or you can alternate whatever works for you. You can do a lateral squat here where we just keep those feet spread apart and alternate whichever works three to five each side, three to five. Guys, after that, take it to the ground, hands to the ground, walk it out to the plank. Walk it back, stand it up. Keep that going, three to five on these, total, three to five, total. Try to keep those legs straight if you can, when we walk it back, as straight as you can. Slight bend in the knees is okay. Donna, your dog's like, why are you doing that? You look like you're sniffing the ground or something. All right, you guys, on that last one, walk it out to that plank, hold that plank here, and let's get some mountain climbers. We're gonna go 30 seconds here on the mountain climbers. 30 seconds, drive those knees, let's get it going. Try to keep those hips down. Keep it going, keep it going. 15 more seconds, keep driving those knees. If you want to throw it into crossovers, drive those knees across, twist those hips. A little bit of extra work there. 10 more seconds, keep it going. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hip stretch and reach, hip stretch and reach. You can throw a push up in between. Alternate sides. What did Randy say yesterday? A little baby push up in between or something like that. I was like, what the heck's a baby push up? Three to five each side, three to five each side. Keep it going. Really try to press those hips down to the ground when we reach you guys. Really try to elongate yourself and push those hips down. Feel that stretch. One more each side. And flip it over to your butts. Give me bicycle crunches, opposite up, opposite knee, reach, reach. This is not for speed. Make sure we get that form right. Try to straighten those legs out, kick each rep, opposite elbow, reach that opposite knee. Really twist those shoulders. Keep it going, eight seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Straight arm sit up, straight arm, straight legs. Reach it up, lay it back. We got eight to 10 here, eight to 10. Nice job, reach the sky. Reach for the sky. Give me a couple more. When you got your eight to 10, go ahead and stand on up, you guys. On your feet, quad stretch and reach. 
alternating sides. Job, nice job. After that, we're gonna pull that ankle and that knee up in front of us. It's nice and tall. Alternate sides on that. Don't fall over. Nice and tall. Nice job, you guys. Nice job. Let's go ahead and get some shoulder circles going. Rotation goes forward first, palms up, rotate it forward. Keep rotating forward, turn those palms down. Backward rotation, palms up. Backward rotation, palms down. And swing it out. Shoulder stretch across the chest. While we do our spirit fingers. Switch sides. Spirit fingers. All right, you guys. Can I get those 10 burpees, please? 10 burpees, no push up. Hop it out, hop it in. Pick it out, pick it in. Big jump at the top to finish off your warm up. Count out those 10 reps and we'll be done with our warm up. Ten reps on those burpees. All right, you guys. Let's go ahead and talk about this workout. I don't know why I keep saying so close. I just want to be close to you guys. All right, so. Here's our workout today. Um, we're going to do three rounds of this. Each round is going to be a different uh, time and a different rep scheme. Okay, so let me turn this music down a little bit so I don't know if you can hear it. Uh, different time, different rep scheme. Uh, so the first round, 90 30. Okay, so 90 seconds of work, 30 seconds of rest. Okay, it's way too generous on the rest time, but you know what? I'm nice today. It's Friday. I'm happy. I'm going to go do it. Okay, 90, 30, the rep scheme for everything, it has two exercises or a right and a left, okay? The rep scheme is three and three, okay? So three on the right, three on the left, or three for the first one, three for the second one. We're gonna do that for the whole 90 seconds, okay? The second round, we go through this again, and it's cutting it down to 60, 20, okay? So less rest time, less work time, and less reps, it's two by two, okay? Uh, and then on the last one, you can see here, it's 30, 15, one by one. So every time, you guys, it's gonna feel a little bit different when we're doing that at whatever exercise combo we're doing, okay? Uh, the combination is gonna feel a little bit different. You can, might be able to move quicker or slower, heavier weight, more weight, whatever works, okay? So we got nine different combos going on here. The first one is a lateral lunge. Very simple, we're starting it off simple. You can use weight with this or not, okay? So kettlebell or dumbbell, it can be here, it can be here, it can be held down here, step it out, reach it out across and back, okay? So make sure we get that lateral lunge. Again, whatever way you're using, it can be dumbbells right here at the shoulders, whatever works for you. We've got three on the right side, and then we're gonna step it out to three on the left side. We've got 90 seconds there. If you're using no weight, really focus on that form. Drop it down as low as you can on that lateral lunge, okay? Really push yourself. Three on the right, three on the left, we're going back and forth for 90 seconds, okay? Obviously, when we cut it down to the uh, round two and round one, where it's two and two and one and one, you're just stepping back and forth like so, okay, on that last round, all right? It's gonna be a lot quicker, maybe push yourself a little bit faster, okay? Next one, you're on your mat on the ground, you've got a knee tuck. Make sure you guys can see me. We've got knee tucks and 90-90 crunch. So when you're here, I want you guys to have those knees bent already at that 90-90, okay? 
From here, you can start out with those arms up. I want you to reach out with those legs and bring them in back to that 90. So you're not gonna tuck all the way in. I want you to come back to that 90 here and stop. And then we have a crunch working the upper body for three. So we've got three here, first round. Okay, then three here, second or first round. And then when we're down to that last round and it's that one and one, I really want you to focus on keeping those knees up at that 90, kick it out, bring them back to the 90, reach up, just lift those shoulders as high as you can, going back and forth, okay? All right, uh, next one. This is a high pull and a push press. Again, this is something that can work with dumbbells, a kettlebell or a band. If we're doing those dumbbells, we're here. If you wanna use those legs for this, that's okay. So a slight bend down, pull it up, elbows go across, drop it right back down. That's our high pull first. On that last one, the second or the third rep, whatever it is, I want you to act like you're cleaning it, bring it to the shoulders to get ready for that next part. From here, it's a push press, slight bend in the knees, press it overhead, bring it back. That's my three right here. I'm gonna drop it right back down in front to start with the high pull again. So at speed, it should look like so I've got my three, one, two, and three. We're here at the shoulders. Press, press, press. As always, like I said, it can be kettlebell. Okay, with that kettlebell, it's like a clean. And then a press overhead with that band. We step into it. You're here, same thing. Pull, pull, pull under the, under the chin, right? And then press, 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 bring it back. On that last round, when it gets a little bit quicker, it's gotta be quick. So it's gotta be a quick pull here under and press over, drop it right back down, pull, press, drop it right back down with the kettlebell or the dumbbells or whatever you got. If you have something that's a little too light, you guys, on that one, I want you to squat a little bit lower. So you can go here to high pull, like so, and then same with that press, squat, press overhead. That's if what you're using is just a little bit too light for you, okay? If you got something heavy, you can always just take it a little bit slower, all right? Um, next one, it's a box pistol squat. So this is where I said you might need a chair or a box or a bench of some sort. You're gonna sit down on it. Obviously, I'll show you a modification that works without a chair or a box, okay? One leg at a time, you can use weight or no weight, okay, from here. I'm gonna push into the ground with that one leg, lift the other one, stand all the way up, hip forward, drop it down. I've got three on the right side, first round. I'm gonna switch it up when I sit down, three on the left side, keep that going. You can hold weight here if you like, okay, or no weight at all, all right? Now, if for whatever reason you don't have a box or anything, that's gonna work for that. Single leg RDLs are also a good uh, option for this. Here, three on the right, three on the left, or, a split stance squat with weight, like so, three and three, switch it up, three and three, okay? Hopefully you have something to sit on, if not, okay? Uh, the next one, army crawlers and hip dips, with or without sliders, I'll show you both. If you got sliders, paper plates, towels, grab those, so. Put those feet on those sliders, those towels, and those paper plates. What we have is three and three on the right side, so I've got one and one, two and two, three and three, okay? You can count it like that or you can count six, I don't care, first rep. From here, we're doing hip dips on each side. One, one, two, two, three, three. From there, we're gonna walk it back. One, one, two, two, three, three. Keep it going just like that. Hip dips on each side. So just make sure on each of these exercises, it is three on both sides, first round two on both sides, second round, one on both sides, last round. Make sense? Is that confusing? Thumbs up? Everybody got that? I wanna see some thumbs up, please. Okay, so make sure we're not confused. That is each side on both exercises, all right? Uh, next one, I'm pretty sure people are gonna hate me for this, but yes, it is jumping jacks and seal jacks, switching back and forth for 90 seconds for the first round, okay? Jumping jacks, one, two, three, switch it up. One, two, three on the seal jacks, switch it up. One, two, three on the jumping jacks. I know you're probably like, why the heck are we doing that? Because 90 seconds of that is gonna be awesome and you're gonna hate me for it. And that's why, okay? It's gonna be a lot more challenging than we think it is, okay? Second round, yep, it's even harder. You gotta think about it. I got one, or two, one, and two. Last round, one, 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 just like that. 
okay? I can't believe I just coordinated that. That was pretty good, all right? Uh, next one, number seven. If you have the box or the chair or the bench, let's use that. If not, we don't have to use that. This is with or without weight, you guys. I'm gonna grab weight to demonstrate. So we got glute bridge and an abductor pulse. I want you to sit low, upper back is on that box. From here, if you're gonna use weight, put that weight right here. I want three reps, glute bridge. All the way up, drive those hips to the ceiling, drop it back down. One, two, and three on that last rep. Hold, if you have a band for your knees, that's great. If not, it still burns just the same. You're gonna hold that last rep. One, two, three, drive those knees outward, bring them back, and then go right back into your three reps here. Second round is two and two. Last round is just one, one, and then keep going one and one, just like that. Try to really hold those hips up as high as you can on that last rep. If you do not have a box or something to use, it's very simple. You just do it on the ground, okay? So you're here, use that weight, hips are up on that last rep. One, two, three, drive the hips down. It's very simple, just without a box, okay? All right, uh, almost there. You can stay on the ground for the next one. It is sit-ups and Russian twists. So, have those knees bent, lay it all the way back. I got my three in the first round. One, two, three, blah, 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 all that stuff. From here, we're gonna sit up. We got Russian twists on each side. Pick those feet up if you can. One and one, two and two, three and three. Go right back into your sit-ups, okay? Second round is two and two. Last round is one and one. Make sure the Russian twists are on both sides. Okay, last one. This might be the best or the worst one, okay? It is a kneel to squat. I have a modification for that and a half burpee, all right? So, I want you guys to actually start in a squat position. Drop it down, hold. When we're going, we're gonna go down to our knees in that kneel position, up to that squat. I'm doing three here. One, two, and three. When we get back up to that squat position, our half burpee, our hands go to the ground, Kick it out to a plank, kick it back up to that, uh, that uh, squat hold position, okay? I've got three here, okay? I go right back into that kneel, the squat three times, so on and so forth, okay? Two and two, one and one. Oh, oh my God, I'm taking forever, all right? And then if you don't want to do that kneel to squat, you can always just squat, body weight squat, and we kick it out for that half burpee, so on and so forth. I took a long time to explain that. That's my bad, okay? All right, we're gonna start it off. 90, 30, lateral lunges, three and three, okay? Look, Elise is even yawning because that took so long, sheesh, sorry. All right, you guys, lateral lunges, three and three on each side with or without weight. Let's get it going in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, you guys, we're going. Three and three on each side. Weight is preferred, please. Let's music up. Three and three, you guys. Three and three. This might seem like an easy first round, but it's going to get crazier. We got one minute to go on this. One minute to go. Nice job, you guys. Nice job. Really keep that other leg straight. As straight as you can. Drop those hips back and down behind you. Nice job. Some of you using one weight. Some of you using two weights. Some of you using stability balls, med balls. Awesome job, you guys. 30 seconds to go. Big step out, you guys. Big step out. We got a long time to rest after this. Way too nice. 15 seconds. Let's go. Let's go. Nice job. In five, four, three, two, one, and time. The next one, you guys. Got a lot of time to rest here. You're doing a deep cut. Remember, 99 is in here to start off with. Kick it out. One, two, three. Let's go shoulders for three. And then keep going back and forth here. Three and three. Just like that. We're going in 10 seconds. 
side. Just get down. If you want to grab a weight to hold over, that's okay. We're going in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, you guys. Let's go. We're moving. We're moving. Kick those knees out for three. Lift those shoulders for three. Try not to completely flatten your body out, you guys. You want to make sure that spine stays flat on the ground on this. You don't want it to be rounded. Try to kick those legs up and out at an angle. Bring them right back in for those uh, crunches. Nice work, you guys. Nice work. This one's going to burn. We are halfway. 45 seconds. 45. Does it burn yet? I know it does. <laughs> At least. <laughs> Come on, you guys. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Really lift those shoulders as high as we can. Very small movements here, you guys. Very small movements. Does not need to be exaggerated. You're going to feel it anyway. 15. All right. Five more seconds, you guys. Don't stop early. Don't stop early. Come on. Three, two, one. Tom. Nice job, guys. Next one. We got that high pull. Push press. So we're here. Slice in the pull. Okay, on that last rep, lean it up over the shoulders. From here, we press. Push press. Slice into the knee. Three and three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Keep it going. We're going in 10 seconds, guys. Get ready. You can be done with a band or a kettlebell, too. Here it is in three, two, one. Let's go. You need to bend those knees more. You want to make it more challenging. Make it a squat and a pull and a squat and a press. I ain't mad at you. Nice job, those of you making it work with the band. Make sure we push those hips back when we do that slight bounce, you guys. Push those hips back. Don't just bend your knees and lean forward. Push those hips back behind. On that third rep, you remember you want to be explosive with it. Bring it up to the shoulders as quick as you can so that way you can go right into that press. Three and three. Let's go, let's go, Amber. Is that way too heavy? That weight looks a little heavy. <laughs> She's like, mm hmm. <laughs> 30 seconds. There we go. Yeah, that's, that's fine. That's fine. If that's too light, just eliminate the leg movement, okay? Just all upper body movement. Are you not pressing overhead? There we go. Come on, girl. 15 seconds, you guys. Let's go. Let's go. Nice job, you guys. Nice job. I know 90 seconds is a long time. Three, two, one, and time. All right, grab that box or that chair. We're doing those pistol squats. We're right here. You can use weight if you want. I've got three on the right, three on the left, going back and forth. Okay? 15 seconds. Like I said, weight is optional. If you want to start early, you can. I know 30 seconds is a long time to rest. Time is on in five, four, third, three, two, one. Let's go. There we go. Get that chair, that box, or that bench. Nice job, you guys. Looks like everybody's pretty much got something that works. Insane in the membrane. If you do not, it looks like everybody does, but if you do not, you can always do a split stance squat or a single leg RDL. We're still just hips back when we sit down, lean into that leg, press the heel into the ground, lift all the way up. Weight is optional. 
45 seconds. Dennis, are we sitting all the way onto the chair or the box or whatever you're using? Put all your weight onto it and then push away. There you go. Thirty seconds. Thirty seconds to go on this. This round may seem monotonous and forever, but as soon as we get down to those sixties, twenties, and thirty, fifteens, man, you're gonna hate me like I hated Randy yesterday. Fifteen seconds, you guys. Let's go. Let's go. Big explosive lift. Nice job. Five, four. Three, two, one, and time. All right. Here we go with the Aussie crawlers, you guys. Sliders or no sliders. If you don't have sliders, you can reach your hands forward and go to those different hips. Just make sure it is three on each side and then three hip dips on each side, okay? If you don't have sliders, you can reach those arms forward and tap the ground in front of you, three and three. Here we go in five. Four, three, two, one. Let's get down to the ground. Let's walk it out on those elbows. They don't have to be long movements, you guys. They can be small movements. As long as you get that three and three on each side. And then hit them three and three on each side. Try not to sway those hips when we're walking it forward. This one's going to suck. I mean, it's going to be great. Positivity, positivity. Really focus on pulling that core in, that belly button in, you guys. Those hips should only sway back and forth when we're doing the hip dips. Try to keep them as straight as possible when you're doing the army crawl. Nice modification, Elise. I like it. 30 seconds to go. 30 seconds. Oh, there's Dave. D Dave, would you hop in here? Put your coffee down and let us get working out. All right. 10 seconds, you guys. 10 seconds. <laughs> Dave, you are messed up, man. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. One and time. All right, guys. Jumping jacks and steel jacks. Three and three. Dude, Carla's going to hate you right now. <laughs> I'm going to put the camera on her while she's so Three and three with the jumping jacks and steel jacks. Three and three. Try to make those transitions smooth, you guys. As smooth as you can. I know it's a lot to think about. We're going in five, four, Three, two, one, let's go. Three and three. 90 seconds of this is ridiculous. It's going to be great. Keep it up, keep it up. Try to bring those arms straight up overhead. If you can connect those hands at the top, by all means do so. If you have shoulder issues and you shouldn't be doing this, then maybe just do steel jacks the whole time. I don't know if you guys can hear this right now, but crisscross jump jump is on right now while we're doing this exercise. I don't know if you can hear it in the background. I mean, it couldn't be more perfect timing. Don't stop really, Cheyenne. Come on, let's go. I know it's ridiculous. I see you stopping, don't you dare. We still have 35 seconds to go of these jumping jacks and seal jacks. Come on, you guys. Try to keep those arms straight if you can. On those seal jacks, it's easy to drop those elbows, but try to extend out as best as you can. Almost there, almost there. Does this seem like an eternity? 10 seconds. Keep going, keep going. Don't you dare stop. Don't stop, don't stop. Three, two, one, time. Nice job, you guys. All right, glute bridges. You can do this on the ground if you need to. I would like weight if possible with this. If not, that's okay. If you have a band strapped 
grab a seat, do that. I've got three here, two are up to the ceiling, and then three on the abductor's pole. And it doesn't need to be the band, it's still gonna burn. Make sure we hold those as high as we can on that pole. Here we go in three, two, one, let's go. Yes, some of you do have ankle bands to put around your knees. Like it. What's going on, Trisha? You good? I'll demonstrate for you here. If you don't have a box, you can do it on the ground. Got three here and three here. Do it on the ground if you don't have a box. One minute to go. Nice job, you guys. Nice job. Really press those hips to the ceiling. Really hold them up when we're doing that abductor pulse. Squeeze the peaches. Nice, you guys. Come on. 25 seconds. Let's go. Let's go. That D back there doing one-legged. Yeah, it sure is. In seconds, let's go. I know it burns. Come on, you guys. Don't quit, don't quit. Hips up, Michelina. I see you back there. Hips up higher. Three, two, one, and time. Nice job. All right, sit up and brush your Sit up here for three. So we need bent. We're going from that last one. We got three rushing twists on each side. Lay it right back for those sit ups. Three and three. Eight seconds. Here we go. In three, two, one. Let's go. Full sit up for three reps. Hold that sit up and those legs up and get those Russian twists going. Oh, Jane's going to be extra and grab a weight. Oh, and Kim and Dennis, all y'all grabbing weights for the Russian twists. You're crazy. I like it, though. I like it. You, re you realize there's like a minute and 10 seconds left, right? <laughs> One minute to go, you guys. Let's go. Let's go. Jen, that wasn't negativity. That was me being, I was just warning you. I wasn't being negative. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 45. 45 left. That's all you have. There's a positive right there. That's all there is left. If you don't want to lift those feet for the Russian twist, you don't have to. If it hurts your low back or something, you can keep them down. That's okay. Nice job, you guys. Nice job. Come on. Really twist those shoulders. Really don't just throw the weight from side to side. I want to see those shoulders twist. There we go. There we go. Ten seconds. It's like fire. Three, two, one, and time. All right. That last one, you guys. Last one, best one. We're starting off in the squat position here. Take it down to the knees. Down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up. Three times. Then we take those hands to the ground. Take it back into that squat. Take it back into that squat for the half perfect three times. Okay? Start in your squat position. Start tall. And I count it off. You should be down to that squat. Take it down to those knees. Here we go in three, two, one. Let's go. Down, down, up, up. Three times. When we come up, hold that low squat. Kick it out, kick it in. For those half burpees, make sure to raise those hands up for those half burpees, you guys. Stay low in the squat. If you need to step it in, step it out for that burpee, that's okay too. You don't have to hop. It's too much impact. Down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up. 
Stay low in that squat. We're halfway. Low as you can, as low as you can. Come on now, 30 seconds to go, 30 seconds to go. Nice, you guys. Lift those hands up off the ground for those half burpees. Lift them up. Wave at me for a split second if you can. 10 seconds, you guys, 10 seconds. Five. Four, three, two, one. That is time for the first round, you guys. 90-second round is done, and it's never coming back, except for maybe, like, a couple of weeks from now. You got one minute off. One minute off that second round. We cut it down to 60-20. 60-20, and the reps are two by two, okay? No more three by threes. It's a regular double-double. It's not, it's not disappointing, it's actually delicious. So remember, 60, 20, 60 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, the transitions, you guys gotta be quicker, okay, going into the next exercise. Carla's making a face like, mm-hmm, yeah, whatever. Next round is in 30 seconds, you guys, let's get ready for it. <laughs> Starting it off with lateral lunges, two and two. With or without weight. Less time means you can use a heavier weight or challenge yourself more, go a little bit lower on that, in that lateral lunge, whatever works. Push yourself. We're going in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, you guys, let's go. 60 seconds of work here. Rep scheme is two by two, two by two. Uh, nice job. Keep that other leg straight. Really sink those hips back as far as we can. Just like that, we are halfway. 30 seconds to go. Two and two. You don't have a whole lot of room to move back and forth. You can always just keep those feet spread apart. You do a lateral squat. Victoria, that wasn't for you. You got plenty of room in that garage. You better do the extra step. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Three, two, one, time. All right, we take it to the knee tuck. 90, 90 front. You only got 20 seconds left here. So, two out. Two out. Two out. Two out. Two out. We're going in eight seconds. Here it is in three, two, one. Let's go. It's not about speed on this one, you guys. It's about control. Small movements, small movements. Remember, we're kicking our feet up at an angle. Try not to completely flatten out on the ground. Halfway, 30 seconds. Really think bringing that rib cage down to your hips when we do that crunch, you guys. Lift those shoulders. Three, two, one. Top. Grab your weight. Grab your band. Grab what you're gonna need for a high pull for two. Clean it up. Pull press or sorry, push press for two. Two and two. Remember on that second rep, make sure it's explosive. Get it up to those shoulders. Then push overhead. Bring it right back down. Here we go in three, two, one. Let's go. There you go. There you go. Nice job, you guys. That second rep is more explosive than the first. You want to challenge yourself and bend those knees a little bit more, squat down a little bit more on each rep. You can. 
Making a squat pull and a thruster. I like the modification, Carla. I like that. Very nice. It's like you're trying to fly away. Nice job, you guys. Come on, 15 seconds to go. Really make sure those elbows are pointed out, you guys. Really flare those elbows out. 10 seconds. Kaylin, what are you using? Three, two, one, time. I can't tell what that is. I have no idea what that is. All right, next one. Pistol squat. Grab your box, grab your chair. Two and two. Grab a weight if you need it. Two on the right, two on the left, two on the right, two on the left. We're going inside. Four, three, two, one. And go. If you don't have that box or that chair or that step stool, you can always do a switch stance squat or you can do a single leg RDL. Make sure we put all of our body weight onto that bench or that chair. And then push through that heel. Woodside, I thought you had something to sit on. <laughs> like, eh. Nice job, you guys. Two and two. 15 seconds. And three, two. One and time. All right, we take it down to the Army Crawlers. Army Crawlers will reach three on each side. And hit this three on each side. Oh, sorry, two, sorry, two, my bad. We're going in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, two and two, two and two. I just wanted to give you guys extra work, I guess. You can reach if you don't have sliders or can't army crawl. Cheyenne, that dog is just all up in your business. <laughs> I can only see some of you. 30 seconds, 30 seconds. Don't stop, Michelina. Don't stop. Come on, girl. Shake your head at me either. I've seen you. <laughs> Try not to sway those hips. Only when we're doing the hip dips. 10 seconds. Let's go. Let's go. Three, two, one. Ah, all right, you guys. Stand it up. We got jumping jacks and steel jacks two and two. I know it's a lot of coordination to think about, but we're going to do it and have fun doing it, okay? Two and two. Jumping jacks and steel jacks. We're going in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, let's go. Try not to pause in between. I know it takes a little bit of thinking, but try not to pause in between. Find that rhythm. Keep it going. Two and two. Two and two. Arms as straight as we can. Again, try not to drop those shoulders on the seal jack. Very, oh, sorry, the elbows. Try not to drop the elbows. It's very easy to do that, I know. Try to keep those arms straight out in front of you. Almost there, almost there, you go, let's go. 15 seconds. And three, two, one, and time. All right, on the ground or on your box or bench, blue bridges, like I said, if you can do it on the ground, just right here, good job. Let's go, let's go. Keep 
You got that band? That's awesome. Around those knees. Nice job. Hold that last one up nice and high. It's a booty burner, you guys. It's a booty burner. Halfway there, halfway there. Squeeze the peaches at the top, you guys. Try not to keep those tips too low. I want to see them high. I want to see them high. Three, two, one, and time. We take it to the ground. Sit ups, Russian twists. Sit ups and Russian twists. All right, eight seconds, and we're going. Make sure the Russian twists are two on each side. Two and two. Let's go. Three, two, one. Time is on. 60 seconds. Let's go. Let's go. Get up for two. Russian twists for two on each side. Looking good, Joy, looking good. I mean, Tracy, I can only see her head pop up once in a while, but looks good. Nice job. <laughs> 25 to go, 25. Hold those feet up when we do those Russian twists if you can. Really twist the shoulders, exaggerate that twist. Don't just throw your hands side to side. Eight seconds. Three, two, one, time. Nice job. Last one. We got that knee to squat. And those half burpees. And then we're starting the squat position. Like so. We're going down, down, up, up two times. And then we got that half burpee two times. Make sure those hands are waving at me when we come up with that half burpee. Here we go in three. Two, one, let's go, 60 seconds, let's go. Down, down, up, up. Try to stay low in that squat. I know it's tough, you guys. Try your best to stay low in that squat when we come up from the knee to squat and for the calf burpee. You're facing your phone or your iPad or your laptop. I want to see you like actually wave your hands when you come up for that half burpee. Thank you. Wave from Elise. Wave from Destiny. I like it. Thank you. Exaggerate it. Don't be afraid to wave at me. I can see you all. Thanks, Donna. All right. Ten seconds. Let's go. Lisa, thank you. Yes. No, get back to work, Lisa. Stop waving and get back to work. Oh, you're killing me. Three, two. One and time, you guys. Nice job, nice job. Take your break. One minute off. I just want to point out for a second that Lisa actually stopped what she was doing to wave at me. Like, exactly. Bye, Daniel. Thank you. Who's leaving? Who is that yelling at me? Oh, Amber. Amber. Sorry, bye. Oh, bye. Me. Have a good one. You too. All right, you guys. All right, so. Last. Last round is one and one, 30-15. The transition's gonna be real quick, only 15 seconds to rest. Daniel, I gotta cut out too. Thank you. All right, Andy, have a good one, man. Have a good one. 30-15, we're gonna go in 20 seconds, you guys, 20 seconds. It's quick, so the lateral lunge is just side to side. Side to side, waving your hands in the air like you just don't care. All right, pick up your weights, we're gonna go in five. Four, yeah, Carla had to stop waving to pick up your weights. Three, two, one, let's go. 30 seconds, side to side. Let's go one and one, you guys, let's go. Last round, we're gonna go a little bit over the normal time, but you know what, that's okay. It's because I talked too much the first uh, explanation. Side to side, side to side. 
at least you and your daughter are in perfect sync. It looks awesome. Five, four, three, two, one. Grab your weight from the knee cup. One, let's go, let's go. Quick transitions, you guys, come on. Kick it out, lift it up, kick it out, lift it up. On this last round, if we can add weight to the things that we didn't have weight before, by all means do so, it's only 30 seconds. Ten seconds to go. Lift and kick, lift and kick. Three, two, one, stop. All right, you guys, it's that high pull. Press. It's just one. Pull it up. Press. Overhead. Bring it back down. One. And one. Just like that. Whatever band or weight you got. Here you go. In three, two, one. Let's go. Let's go. Pull and press. Pull and press. If you want to throw a squat in it, that's awesome. Elbows really flare out with that, with that pull. Catch it up under the chin. Press it overhead. Halfway there. Let's go. Let's go. Nice job, you guys. Nice job. Three, two, one. Time. All right. Next one is those box crystal squats or split stand squats or single leg RDL. One and one. Just switching legs back and forth. Grab a weight if you have it. Let's go in three, two, one. Let's go, let's go. Nice job, you guys. One and one. Switch legs, each one. Ten seconds. Nice job, Gina. Looking good, girl. Three, two, one, and time. We take it down to the ground. Army crawlers, just one and one up. All right, and hip dips on each side, one and one. Let's go in five, four, three, two, one. Again, if you don't have sliders, we're just doing plank reaches, one and one, and then hip dips on each side. It's quick movements, you guys. Nice job, you guys. I like it. Looking good, Kimberly Rowe. Three, two, one. Time. Next one. Stand it up. Jumping jacks. This is where it's going to get kind of crazy and confusing. We got one and one. One and one. I know it sucks. Here we go. In five. Four, three, two, one. Let's go, let's go. 30 seconds on. I like those of you that started early. All making me happy. Arms straight the whole time. Arms straight the whole time. It's only 30 seconds total time. We've got 10 left.
Try not to put those feet down. I'm talking to you, Megan and Lisa. Try not to put those feet down. Three, two, one, time. All right, last one, kneel to squat, half burpees. This one is quick, you guys, down, down, up, up, kick it out, kick it in, down, down, up, up, kick it out, kick it in. Here it is in three, two, one. Let's go, let's go, this is the last thing. It should be quick, it should be quick. Halfway, halfway, come on. Dennis, are you using a weight with this? Of course, Dennis would figure out how to use a weight with this, man. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go, you guys. Keep it going. Do not stop early. We got five, four, three, two, one. That is time, you guys. That is time. Nice job, everybody. Nice job. Unmute all. Awesome work, you guys. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Hi. Thank you. Where are you at? Thanks, Daniel. Have a good weekend. Thank you. Guys, all right. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Love you. Bye. 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 Thanks, Daniel. Welcome. You're welcome. Donna's over here. Look, oh, Jordan. Nice job. Nice workout. Just because my yesterday. legs are dead. Yeah. All the squats and lunges yesterday, and now today. Right, right. Yeah, it was a lot of legs. It was a lot of legs yesterday and today. That's why I was so mad at uh, Randy. I was so pissed. Off. <laughs> I was pissed off. Good shot, good guys. Good shot. What is what? How did I do? Oh, I thought I'd move around. It's really. Bye, Carla. Bye. Have a good day, everybody. Yeah. Carla. Daniel. on the ground right now. Bye, Dan. Dan. Later, Dan. Later. Bye. Smile. Daniel, Bye, smile. I'm going to take a picture of us. Ew, no. Daniel, uh, smile. So, got moved. No more stairs until later. Bye, Dennis. Who's that? Is Daniel, that, um, smile. <laughs> Thanks. All right, all right, Bye. Hi, Vicky. Vicky, I can't hear you. Turn your mic on. Daniel, there. Yeah. yeah. I can hear do you now. Do we have Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, or do we have a Mother Day too? Um, it's Monday, Wednesday, Friday for me, and Randy does Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. Oh. So we have six days. Okay, six days. Okay, six days mm -hmm. of trying to figure this out. Yes, okay. exactly. <laughs> and where do I get the link that logs me in every day? Should get it through email, but now, um, are you on Facebook? No. Okay. Uh, you should get it through your email then. Are you not getting your e the, get it, get it through email? I didn't see it in my email. The last two times I've had the email, uh, text Saco for it. Okay. All right. Well, yeah, because we have a Facebook group that we have it on now, like a set group for the Zoom workouts. Okay. Um, and so if you're on that, the link's going to be there every time. Otherwise I would, it'd probably be through email. Okay. So, okay. yeah. Well, I'll, 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 I'll mess with Facebook. I turned it off because it was so annoying. So, but I'll turn it back on. If, yeah, if you can, I mean, because it's going to be there for sure every time. I think Sokol wanted to kind of stop emailing because not all people like you are receiving the emails, you know. So I think he wanted to just kind of eliminate that and make, make it so people can go see it. But I know not everybody has Facebook either. So um, I'll, uh, I'll, I'm going to uh, see what he's actually here right now. I'm going to ask him real quick. Okay, because uh, I tried to find it in Instagram a couple times and I couldn't find the link. Oh, yeah. No, it's not going to be on Instagram, I don't think. Um, yeah, it's either Facebook or email. Like I said, I'll, I'll ask him and I'll have him uh, contact you. Him and, Mariah. Okay, and I have another question for you. Sure. In your auto, in your auto business, did you know of anyone that could fix the plastic stuff on Carling's car, repaint it? Should oh, to have that done. I do actually, and I wasn't sure if I had anybody because I used to have a paint guy from years ago, 
and I just reached out to him uh, earlier this week and asked if he could do something for me. Now he does it out of his garage. He used to work at a shop, but he, he kind of retired and he started doing it out of his garage. Um, so he's, it takes him a while to get through jobs because of that. So he told me to you know, reach back out to him in a few weeks for what I needed. So um, I can definitely ask him though, if, if it can wait, you know, maybe a month or so. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. there's no hurry. Okay, okay, yeah, I can reach out to him. Uh, like I said, he's a really nice guy. He's, he did my paint work for years and then I thought he retired, but he's actually still doing it. So um, okay. I'll definitely, I'll contact him. When I, when I get back to him about what I need, I'll, I'll tell him that I have somebody else interested. Thank you, Daniel. That would be great. She's been bugging me to ask you. So. <laughs> yeah, no problem. No problem at all. So. All right. Thank you, sir. That was a great workout. All right. Thanks. Uh, so, yeah, we are six days a week. So, you know, you get Randy for half the time and me for half the time. Same time. Same time, 9 a.m. Every day but Sunday. Okay. Perfect. Thank you, Daniel. Right. Have a good Bye. one, baby. Bye.